Hey y'all, today I'm going to try to teach you a little bit about trying to figure out if your chicken is a rooster or a hen. It is really the number one thing that people ask a lot is when they're little they say is this a rooster and a lot of times it's, it can be difficult to tell. So I'm going to start you off with my boy Leroy. Hi Leroy. You're a good boy. Yes you are. Okay, so roosters have two distinct parts to their body that's going to separate them from a hen. One is their hackle feathers are going to be long and pointy, and these are the hackle feathers on the rooster. So if you look at it, Leroy's feathers, they all come to a point. The other part on a rooster is the saddle feathers, and the saddle is actually an area where you would think you would put a saddle on a horse, well, just imagine there's a saddle on the back of your chicken. So these feathers are considered the rooster saddle feathers. And if you look, they come down and they swoop to a point like a saddle. So again, these are gonna be long. So that is gonna be something that really sets apart your chicken from a male and female. So either a rooster or a hen. So I'll show you what a hen looks like in a light brahma, which is what Leroy is. I'll show you a light brahma female, which is considered a hen, and then you'll be able to tell the difference. So here's Mr. Leroy. He's got the cackle feathers and the saddle feathers, gorgeous as he is. And then let me show you a, a girl, so you can see. So here we are, we have a hen, which is a light brahma. So this is a girl, and we're gonna look at the two areas that we looked at on Leroy. This, we're gonna look at her hackle feathers. So if you look at her hackle feathers, they may appear to be pointy, but they're actually, if you look at the feather, it is rounded at the tip. So his were very pointy, hers are rounded at the tip, at the edge of that. And now we're gonna look at her saddle, and with a girl, it does not look like you put a saddle on a chicken. It just looks like her rounded feathers continue on from her back gracefully into her tail. And that, if you look at that area, these are all rounded feathers where Leroy's feathers were pointed. So it's still considered a saddle area, but the girls, they don't look like you put a saddle on. So this is a female. She just started laying. Yes, you're very proud of that. I'm going to show you what a uh, male looks like at her age because she's about three months old and I have some three month old boys. And this is where you're really gonna have to look and see, dig in there and see if you can find these things on them because you're not going to be able to really tell, I know darling, until they get about three or four months old. Unless they crow. I mean, if they're crowing, it's quite possible that it's a boy. Sometimes, I mean, I do have a couple of females that crow, so it's not always 100%, but if we can find those uh, those pointy saddles on one of the, the juveniles that I have, then you'll be able to get an idea of what it looks like to actually find one in a younger animal. With uh, another juvenile, he's about three months old for this guy. So we're going to look at the hackle area. His hackle feathers here are very pointed. They come to a very sharp point as opposed to where hers were a little rounded at the tip. So that's your first indication that this juvenile is actually a rooster. So then we're going to swing him over to his saddle area. And just looking at him from far away, you don't see a saddle. But if you look very close and you part the feathers that he has that are already coming in, you can see that his saddle is actually starting to come in. And that are very pointed feathers. On the other side, there you go. There's his saddle, there's his points, and they're starting to come in. Sorry, baby. It's okay. It's all right. He's also starting to get some of the telltale signs of uh, larger feathers on the back that have a green sheen to it, but some females also get this. So if you really want to know and you're about three or four months, you got to look at the hackles and you have to look to see if there's a saddle. Before that, unless you know how to vent sacks, which is what the hatcheries do when they're first going, they turn them over and they squeeze their vent and they, they look to see if it's a male or female. You know, even most chicken breeders don't know how to do that. So most of us will wait until we can see these saddles coming in to actually know that it's a confirmed rooster. 
So thanks for joining us today. I hope this helped a little bit. If you have any questions, you can just put them down in the comments and hopefully we can address them in some uh, further videos. And as always, like and subscribe. Thanks, y'all.